Hi, I'm Paul McGee, author of the book, How Not To Worry. I want to explore with you an amazingly simple formula on how to deal with stress. Three letters I want to give you now. E plus R equals O. I came across this from a guy called Jack Canfield and I want to bring alive what those three letters are and how they're going to help you deal with your stress. Before I do, let me just share with you um, a TV documentary I saw a few years ago. It was about neighbours who didn't get on well. There was a couple here in their 50s who were into bird watching. They lived next door to another couple, also roughly in their 50s, not into bird watching, but living with elderly mother. One day the woman here, she spots a bird in a garden she hasn't seen before. So what does she do? She grabs the binoculars and starts looking at this bird. Now after a while, the bird flew over into next door neighbor's garden. What did she do on automatic pilot without thinking? She follows the bird. At that precise moment, elderly mother here, she was in the conservatory. She looks up at the same time when we're next door's looking into a garden. She thought she was being spied upon. Her son was interviewed for the documentary. When he was interviewed, he said the following. When my mother saw she was being spied upon, she was devastated. We had no choice but to grow these fast growing conifers. So they planted these trees between their property and their property. The trees grew fast, they grew tall. After a while, it just blocked out this couple's light. And their response, oi, any chance of like turning them down by about 15 feet? Family over here went, no, absolutely not. Couple here went, right, if you don't, we'll take you to court. These people, oh, I'm scared, go on then. Do you know what? It went to court. Guess how much it cost in court and legal fees over a three year period to resolve the issue? 50 thousand pound but you know what as a story i think it brilliantly brings alive e plus r equals o let's see what those three letters are about and why they will impact you the e stands for event and in that situation what was the event oh i'm being looked at through a pair of binoculars the o stands for outcome and their outcome was 50 grand in court and legal costs fast growing trees and probably a shed load of conflict and stress. So what does the R stand for? The R stands for this, response. You see, so often in life we get stressed, we end up with this outcome, stress, anxiety, worry, and we go, I got this because of that, because of the event, but actually E plus R equals O is saying, hang on a minute, it's not simply the event, it's not simply your challenges, it's also how you're responding, you're part of the formula, you're in the equation that influences the outcome. I mean, let's be honest. Imagine it was an elderly mother in the conservatory, imagine it was you. You've just seen next door neighbor looking at you through a pair of binoculars. Hey, one of your responses would be, and is said to be devastating to grow fast growing conifers. But of course you might have done something else. You might have just waved back. You might have actually just chosen to ignore it. You might have gone round and asked them what the flipping net they're getting up to. You may even have revealed a part of your body. But is it fair to say, if you'd have responded differently to this family, you'd have ended up with a different outcome? Of course it is, it's obvious. But isn't it interesting how sometimes rational, intelligent, successful people do stupid things and miss the obvious? See, here's the reality, folks. Sometimes when we're emotionally involved, we don't always see so clearly how to respond. So maybe for you to deal with your stress more, just recognize, first of all, it's not the event simply, but also how you choose to respond that will influence your outcome. And maybe you need somebody just to help you who's less emotionally involved to perhaps provide some fresh perspective on your event and maybe to give you some support on how to respond in order to create some better outcomes. You see, when you have that formula E plus R equals O, it won't be a magic wand, but it might just help you to stress less and enjoy life more.